Ding dong, ding dong, blah. Tap tap. It's Primla in the school. What the hell is going on? Everybody. And the crowd goes wild. Sorry, man. I mean, I know I like went through an entire arena scene without even realizing it. But you know, if it's a Shia scene, if Shia makes an appearance, I will stop. Like right there. <laughs> I don't know why. It's like through all these routes, just like skip everything except for whenever the character in question appears in the scene. She was also laughing as she watched them. It's to save time, you know, it takes forever. Primula tapped Shia on the back. I wonder if she's trying to cheer her up. And then I didn't care again. Like I got you your lunch. Amazing chef! What is it? What the hell did I do? Was it because I skipped everything? Our humble islands were officially in the rainy season and it was raining again today as expected. I uh, didn't care. Didn't care. Didn't care. I can't be honest reading all this. I mean, I like to read, but how many times have we freaking had to read this? However, my complaints were going to stop the weather, I guess, weren't going to stop there, I mean, I guess I'll just go home now. However, let's look around a little longer. Ninka, Ninka. Hora, hora. Ame da yo, ame. I haven't seen no, this scene, no, actually, uh, no, 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 no. since the first route that we went through. Dark and troubled. Her bright, excited voice instantly disproved my theory. I had no idea why, but she was looking out the window and jumping up and down with excitement. You don't need to be that impressed. Besides, I hate rain, I get wet and depressed, and I hate holding an umbrella. But at least some will be coming once it's over, I'm excited in that sense. Now when it comes to rain, if I'm outside and it's raining, I never have an umbrella, really. Like, I've got a coat, trench coat, so it's like, yeah, that just keeps you warm, just one floor in that, it has no hood! So like, the rain will just like, be like, okay, 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 fine. Quite annoying, really. So, I don't mind rain as long as it's not constant. As long as there are days where it's not a grey sky, because that's just freaking bland. I hate that. Perhaps I felt that was uh, that way as a child, but not anymore. No way. Like Mary Poppins? She a Poppins. If she could fly like that, the right brothers would be spinning in their graves. As excited as you are, it would be hilarious if you said that you forgot your umbrella. Uh. Hey. You're my neighbor, I don't even mind. But it's embarrassing because as you can see here... However, the other people around us were eerily curious, the students we passed kept on staring. They had already been teasing me about Kaine, so I was used to getting attention like this. She and I got close under the umbrella as the rain continued to pour without hesitation. We walked home as we listened to the drops of water pitter-pattering on the ground. Uh, what's wrong? I asked as I noticed her looking up at me. She shook her head with a happy face. Just there. 
she replied with joy. I'm not doing anything special for you. She looked at my right shoulder. My shoulder is left side, the umbrella and the soaked shirt is sticking to my skin. It's not like that, don't worry. As I shyly looked away, she let out a chuckle. What? She was always straightforward with her feelings. Sometimes it made me feel embarrassed, but I never disliked it. There are plenty of guys who are nicer than I am. All the other guys at the school seem like assholes. She said with an airy tone as she smiled, she brought her body closer to me. You don't have to worry. I could feel her warmth, I felt embarrassed, but didn't do anything because it felt so good. We stopped chatting, possibly because we were out of topics, but more likely because we were simply getting nervous. However, she continued to smile like she was having a good time walking with me. Maybe she was generally happy. Even though we weren't talking, she was happy about the fact that we were there to kill her. The Shivan Ah, send her by a full name now. Shianfis was the type of girl who uh, could really appreciate the little things. She knew how to be joyful. I could hear the sound of raindrops hitting the ground. The rain continued to fall. After all, this rain might not be too bad. Did I feel that way because of the girl walking beside me? She was beside me, she was smiling beside me. This wasn't bad at all. Then suddenly thunder and lightning and you just randomly shit yourself because of how sudden it was. It's like, oh good god! God, it was looking for something inside a closet when I popped into a room that morning. Did you knock, though? That's the important thing. I don't think he did. But we're skipping through the scene because I don't really give shit. Always gonna have that scene, isn't it? With those hills. Wait for it. I wonder how the anime version handled that scene if they even had it. I don't even know. Wouldn't be surprised if they completely skipped it, really. And then it pissed down. Hills. And then the hills were gone. The hills have nipples. <laughs> no, the hills. Yeah, whatever. Ding dong. Who's at the door? I can't. Yeah, remember. yeah. Oh, it was you. Ah, uh, cute. He appears more than the king of the gods, really, doesn't he? I don't really like, oh, but we just get used to Brimler with her hills and everything. And now she's gone. Which, then she must return in a few days, but whatever. Rene said as she looked outside, what were we talking about? Oh yes, the rain. It had been raining since morning and everyone looked, everything looked grey through the window. Don't you just hate that? It's like, ugh, god damn, that's just, uh, such, such scenery just makes you feel depressed. This is Japan's rainy season. This is also considered whales weather all year round, usually. Just look outside, it's like, where the hell is anything that's... Where's the sun? Where is the blue sky? Where is it? Why is there always clouds? And it's like a tradition to eat inside the classroom during this season. I 
Sorry, I'm not going to be able to You know, as much as I complain about the weather here in Wales, if I went to a warmer country, I'd probably say, fuck this shit, I'm going back home. Because, like, it's freaking be too boiling. Because, like, I'm used to this cold and I'm used to this cold by the well, you know? Eh, I'm in a little bit of 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 a little bit uh, some humans are like rain too. I didn't know she was that kind of person. Ore Samaranka, I'm in a Moshigo that one. Yapari Amenashi Jeseva Katarina. Eh, Sano Kokora? Aya Igasan, do you see my cook on there? Do to Jose to meet Chakri. That's not very good news for the lady. You seem to not like rain there, Rene. You've been looking outside with a sad face. You like sunny days, huh? Yes. I'm and with beyond that, I don't like boiling days, but I like when there's actually a blue sky and you can see the sun. Those are the better days. It's not overly bright, but it's blue sky and you can see the sun. It's somewhat bright, but not overly bright. It's not cold and it's not overly warm. It's kind of balanced, which is kind of rare sometimes. You know, if I went to the US, I imagine it would be so all over the place, be like, it's colder than when I was in freaking Wales, what the fuck? Or it could be like, Jesus Christ, I'm freaking burning here, man! I remember, I think it was last year, we had like some really warm days. It was like, jeez, man, I can't barely breathe. The weather is just excruciatingly freaking warm. Then at the time, I was like, so what about the rest of the world? The US is like freaking 20 times more than that. Like, fuck that. I bet you don't do any grocery shopping at all. Why don't you try and work like a housewife too? No way. Why is it always housewives? I mean, look at everyone else's lunchbox in all. カエデと土見こんのは当然として、シアちゃんもリンちゃんも三食揃って彩りも栄養バランスも完璧そう。やっぱり自分で作ってるの？うん、朝ごはん作るついでに。どんなおかずでようかなって考えるのが楽しいん
wasn't there an episode of The Simpsons I'm thinking of where I think Homer might have like set fire to like his cereal at some point and just caught fire for no reason? I can't remember. Maybe it was something else. Huh? It oh. might be trying to block it out from your memories, but remember. The King of the Devils is a very unique character. Remember how he brought that crazy five-dollar lunchbox to her before? I know I've already had one. I placed my hand on the ring's shoulder and took my head. You're torturing her by asking that. <laughs> Kade looked away with a sad face. What girl made it for you today? だいたい昨日は3年の先輩じゃなかったその前は隣のクラスの子だしねあ、別に驚くことじゃない日替わり弁当という言葉があるだろうえっとあのそ、そのよ最悪June 29 for rain I reassert that he is the worst guy out there from the bottom of my heart. Ah, uh, don't make me help before P.E. My god, we actually have plot that we haven't seen! Well, a scene that we haven't seen anyway, I can't really call it plot. I mean, it's just scene after scene, and then we get the plot. The bell already rang a while ago, so I was walking down the empty hallway by myself. My next class was physical education, we were going to play basketball in a gym. But then he just like, oh no 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 Soccer outside right now in this weather? What? There have been games that have been played in the rain. Get out there! As I walked down the stairs, reminiscing about the conversation with my classmates, someone suddenly called my name. Miku! Hey, Shia. Shia was coming down the stairs towards me in her gym clothes. The girl's dressing room was upstairs, so she was heading towards the gym as well. What's wrong? It's rare for you to be late for PE. Pretty much the same thing. I was helping the teacher and I wound up being late. But I have a perfect excuse, so it's helping the teacher, it's no problem. You might want to hurry up though, I heard Miss Yuri is not in a very good mood today. Then it's like, you know, we're going to have laps around the gym today. Are you kidding me? I just rushed all the way here about an energy. Yeah, good luck. She ran down the stairs in a hurry. In a hurry? What do you mean, in a hurry? It's too bad I don't have any images of uh, the protagonist. He's just not the same as Tomoya, so we don't have a Tomoya approved in, like, kind of Rin approved. It's just not the same, man. You'll never be able to live up to that expectation, Rin. You'll never be Tomoya. However, she hurried too much and tripped over her own feet. Her body threw itself onto the air and fell towards the landing in slow motion. Whoa! Shia! I quickly reached out to her and managed to grab her gym clothes. But I imagine it'll probably be fan service. I mean, that's usually how these things turn out, right? Her body stopped in midair. It's fan service, alright! <laughs> Who would have guessed we'd see fans ever in a scene like this? Why am I sounding like an announcer? The scene in front of me was too enticing. 
It seemed awkward. She was grabbing the rail with her right hand, her left hand, and my hands putting her in an unbelievable position as people didn't walk by, because if they did, that would make this a whole lot more awkward. However, the problem was that I grabbed hold of sheer shorts. Her shorts stretched in my hand before they were pulled down. Still, it's got nothing on the Mayumi one. Her lower regions were in a vulnerable position. This is an accident. You, you got it, Chia? <laughs> well, if it's an accident, let go. I mean, don't like pull too far back. I mean, if you let go in that way, you'd be like, OW! Her face turned completely red. Thank goodness there wasn't anybody else around. Then Tsuki shows up. I wanted to try and pull her up and save her as soon as possible. Wait. You grabbed her in mid-air, right? So, wait, what? Is she still in mid-air and you just, like, got her with one hand? Wait, how is that even possible? Uh, what shall we do? If all of us let go, she would definitely fall. Seriously, how is he doing that? Sometime it's amazing to how much, know how much power I actually have. I'm impressed I was able to save her from that situation. How do you have time to talk, man? You were holding her up like that? Wait. That, why did he... Never mind. Um, uh, well... But seriously, wouldn't you just, like, leave go, just, like, grab her... Not, like, rigging grab her shorts. Just like by the shoulder or something and just like lift her back up or something, I don't know. How the hell? How the hell did he even catch her in time anyway? I know it was an accident, but I gotta see something very nice. I mean... Is that the same thing with Narita, didn't he? How predictable that scene was, though. I don't know what to say. Then she continues running and realizes she hadn't pulled up her shorts. Well, that's bullshit. We can clearly see they've been pulled up. She started running down the stairs again. Wherever she hit her face as she did so. Well, what should I say? I felt like my heart just gained something vulnerable. I mean, valuable. Messing up my lines. That was a whole scene, ladies and gentlemen. Just to establish some fan service. Hmm. Fan service. I checked the clock. It said, no fan service today. Wait, why would a clock say something like that? God, ah! My god, she's been knocked unconscious! Well, she's not anymore. You know, next time that, uh... She, uh, like, hits her dad with a chair, I'm totally gonna insert Jim Ross commentary. Well, what's up? Haven't I stopped at this point before? And I'm going to again anyway, because why not? Well, anyways, I'll see you next time, viewers. See you next time.